the act of meditation has been grossly misinterpreted and misunderstood, as we have got so many different types of prayer, sports, vocations, religions, personalities, so have we got different types of meditation. Meditation types are numerous and diverse. Unfortunately, all the teachings and references to meditation have been centered on mindfulness, which involves breathing methods, guided imagery, and other practices to relax the body and mind and help reduce stress. This type of meditation suits the monks, the hermits, the loners, the Aramites, and the solitaries, but we don't all belong to these groups. While mindfulness practice is okay, it is not intended for everyone especially for our contemporary times full of interruptions, digressions, and busy schedules. Many people have given up on meditation simply because of the total misunderstanding of this beautiful and rewarding endeavor. As the world evolves, knowledge is increasing, and we need to keep abreast of the latest advances, revolutions, and innovations. Our ability to leverage this effectively will guarantee an improved and balanced life. On this channel, we are focused on Christian meditation inspired by the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ through the undiluted Word of God. In the book of Joshua, chapter 1, verse 8, the Bible says, Keep this book of the law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. Keep this book of the law always on your lips simply means you must always be talking it. As a Christian, the material you need for your meditation is the undiluted word of God. The Hebrew word used here is the word Haggad, which means to murmur, to ponder, to imagine, to mutter, to muse, to cogitate, to contemplate, to reflect, to study, to purpose, to moan, to growl, to speak, to intend, to give order, to care for, to attend to, to plan, to devise. These actions require deep thinking, where your thoughts, feelings, and emotions are more real to you than your physical experience and include saying it under your voice and shouting it. This reveals that the act of meditation is beyond plain mindfulness. There are other activities involved in meditation. With proper and adequate understanding and practice of meditation on the Word of God, you can go beyond relaxation and restfulness. You can witness and feel God's tremendous love. You can revitalize your soul, rediscover your joy, break every barrier and limitation of sickness and poverty to live the higher form of life in Christ Jesus. The field of meditation is so extensive and diverse, and the good news is that there is a type that suits your personality, environment, and plan. You should know that meditation is largely about engaging the use of a particular equipment which God fashioned in you when you were being created. This equipment is called the mind. Overall, there are seven types of meditation from which you can choose. We have just mentioned mindfulness where the focus is the strong awareness of what you're sensing and feeling in the moment without analysis or judgment. As stated earlier, this isn't for everyone. We also have creative visualization where you imagine, foresee, and picture a particular outcome based on the creative power of the Word of God working in your mind. The third type is intuitive meditation, where the Holy Spirit distills ideas and solutions in your mind as you yield yourself to Him. Fourthly, we have imagery therapy or energy medicine a process through which individuals receive supernatural healing by engaging the healing power of the Word of God. The fifth type is forgiveness practice, where you get rid of all the negative thoughts, unforgiveness, bitterness, muck, 
waste, excess weight, debris, weighing you down, thereby liberating and energizing yourself to fulfill purpose and destiny. Number six is connection meditation, where you put into practice your nature of being the light and salt of the earth through prayer of compassion to bring peace. Lastly, the seventh type is reprogramming meditation. Here, you essentially reprogram your mindset through the practice of commands and visualization. We shall be going deeper into each one of these processes in our subsequent videos. If this video has blessed you, we want you to like it, share it with your friends, feel free to leave some love in the comments, and hit the subscribe button if you want to learn more about Christian meditation. God bless you as you thrive in the atmosphere of grace.